Hello, welcome to my introductory video. Let me introduce myself. I am River. I am a part-time artist and absolutely obsessed with all things um, makeup, sci-fi, and Asian dramas. So, that's me. I bet you're wondering what this channel is going to be. First and foremost, I'm not going to use any gimmicks. There's not going to be any professionally cut and smooth videos like you see out there. This is very, very amateur and very kind of casual and laid back. For the most part, it's going to focus on art. Um, as you see behind me, all of these, these are all my paintings. Um, I'm, not, I'm not that bad. Now granted, you will find much better artists out there um, in, in YouTube alone that will help, will actually teach you and walk you through each piece. Uh, these, by the way, will, I will, uh, I'm not going to redo this video, by the way, so there's going to be a lot of mess ups. I've already done it like three times. I'm an insomniac, so don't sleep that much. Anyway, <clears throat> um, so I'm going to be able to let you watch, let you, I'm going to invite you to watch me paint. I'm not really teaching, however, you can use the techniques that I'm using. And if I'm using something, if I learned something on somebody else's YouTube channel, I will link it in the descriptions, allowing you to be able to go and see whatever it was that helped inspire or teach me something specific. Um, it, let me see if I have an example back there. Uh, that's not back there. I actually did, um, she's over there, you'll see her later. I did a painting of a um, ethereal blue lady. And I currently have a uh, albino um, woman on my dock. And on my uh, canvas, uh, canvas. <laughs> my tired, I'm tired, on my easel. Um, so you'll see that, and that's what I'm painting currently, so that'll be my next video, not the non-introductory one, will be the um, albino, albino lady I'm painting. And during it, I will use, while doing videos, I will use it in an almost blog fashion. I will tell stories I've heard, random interesting facts, and if I can, I'll try to teach you what I'm doing at the same time. Um, sorry, movie browser, you, you, you gotta get used to this. If you plan to stick around on my channel, I use this all the time. This is nicotine and, um, helped me quit cigarettes about three years ago. Anyway, moving on. Um, so mostly it's going to focus on art. However, there'll be a couple of, um, small things that'll crop up that are different, but they'll be labeled like, um, Asian drama reviews or sci-fi reviews of new things, uh, like the new Doctor Who, the new season. I don't know if you guys watch the Doctor Who, but it's really neat. Um, and so on and so forth. Uh, reviews of purchases sometimes, but again, mostly this is going to be art and um, the creation of art. As I said, my name is River, obviously. It's a pseudonym. Um, and for the most part, I'm pretty, uh, I can't say I'm interesting, but I'm not boring. Uh, I read all the time. You, you can't see all my books. or You will see them though soon because my painting is in the library. I already ruined the carpet, so I can't move it out of there. <laughs> uh, anyway, so I'll ask you to join me and, you know, just for company, just for fun, and maybe tell you some stories interesting stuff. I'm a single, or not single, I'm a mom, and I have a daughter, so sometimes she'll crop up in these, by the way, um, purely by accident, not invitational, though I might do something with her sometime, like dual painting. She likes to paint, but uh, she doesn't like to use the techniques. Um, moving on. Um, anyway, <laughs> this is going to be a terrible introductory video. They say that it was very, very important to do a really good first one. And I know, uh, but I'm the kind of person that if I'm going to do something, I will research it in depth. Uh, so that's what I did. <laughs> and it made me nervous because it's really harsh. All the words are what everybody says. It's all your introduction, your introduction video needs to be quick, swift. People only watch the first 30 minutes or 30 seconds. And <laughs> it's like, ah. How do I remember all this? I'm the kind of person who goes off on tangents, you know? You're talking about one thing, so like right now, I'm on a tangent. 
And anyway, so paintings, stories, random facts, um, little uh, tidbits of things I learned along the way. Like, oh, here's here's a good example. This, by the way, goes back to to this channel's rated PG thirteen or fourteen, whatever. Uh, there might be some minor language cussing on occasion, but m not too too much. Uh, oh, there's a hair in my mouth. Um, I, I'm not going to wear any skimpy outfits, no gimmicks, no special things. Like I said, very, very raw. Um, but yeah, so no like mass amounts of cleavage or butt hanging out. I'm not going to do backflips or roll around in my paint. And, uh, it'll be just very, very basic, you know, normal. <laughs> um, so I do hope you guys will join me. Uh, one of the things I say is to ask you guys to subscribe. I'm not going to because it annoys the crap out of me. Have you ever been watching? You, you looked up YouTube. I, I'm always on YouTube. <laughs> you looked up on YouTube and you finally got found what you wanted. And then like they start to talk and they're like, you know, I'll see the subscribe button down there. And uh, anyway, so I'm not going to do that. Um, if you subscribe, you do. If you don't, you don't. Uh, So the type of facts that I'll probably impart are various things such as um, I'm really big into different languages. I can't claim to be a linguist, a linguist, but I do pick up languages really easy and fairly quick. Um, so I know a pretty decent amount of Korean uh, mixed. So in the Korean language, here's one of those facts. So in a lot of the Asian languages, there's two different um, types. <sighs> Not types. Two different ways to speak. You have polite speech, which is formal, and then there is informal. You'd use informal with family, lovers, that kind of thing, and you use formal everywhere else. So um, I have a hard time sometimes to differentiate which one's formal, which one's not. I know a little bit of Spanish, um, Japanese. I'm working on a, a Mandarin Chinese, but it's really, really hard. Chinese is one of the hardest ones I've been trying to pick up. Um, anyway, so just basically I know a little bit of all the different languages and I love cultures. I love delving into all those details and discovering just like fascinating things. So I was always very obsessed with the, um, world history. Uh, the blog thing, you get to know a little bit about my life in general, you know, how my day was, what I'm doing. Um, and, and I'm not talking like I did dishes. <laughs> Which probably will happen, but you won't see that. And I'm not going to talk about it because we all do dishes, right? Um, I'm not going to do these like super fancy makeup tutorials. You probably won't see me in makeup very often. I'm wearing some, but this is as much as you're going to get. See? Look, there's my lip stain. I might have a little bit of pink in there. There you go. My makeup. <laughs> but mostly, you're going to get to see me in pajamas painting. Um... Let's see, I have paint on me right there. And I will help give you some tips and tricks. Do a little blog along the way. Talk about various things. Um, so not, like I said, sometimes very sick and tired. <laughs> so I might end up doing this introduction, redo this introduction video later. But right now I just wanted to get something out there because I had this channel ready, right? And I was so intimidated. Every time I'd go to sit down and do it, it's like, I'm not ready. They say the first one has to be perfect. Anyway, so um, I hope you do enjoy the channel, and I hope you enjoy the art. I'll help, I will try to help, I don't want to say teach, but um, what's the word, uh, show, show you how I do these things. Um, I don't know if I've lifted this up yet so that you can see, because this is my third time trying to do this, but I'm going to show you some of the paintings behind me. I have more paintings, and I've painted more paintings, and I've sold them, I do sell them, um, I have a website and everything, so if you find them. Uh, anyway, so I'm going to show you the ones behind me. These are fairly basic. Um, I have more complex ones in different places in the house. I just started learning to paint portraits, and I'm obsessed. Not portraits of live people, but um, imagined and created, you know, that kind of thing. Um, anyway, so as you see... I work in a variety. We have abstracts, uh, somewhat still life, 
uh, scenic and well there's more of the ship but um, I wonder if I could take you over there to see my blue lady do you want to see my blue lady she's really pretty she, I'm very very proud of her so I'm gonna tilt you over here to see my blue lady I'm gonna switch it around so you get a really good camera too because the other side of the tablet has much better camera there's my blue lady. Um, I painted her. She's one of my best pieces of work. One of my favorites. I'm very, very proud of the eyes. The hair was a little bit of a struggle. Hello, I'm back. So I'm going to take you over to the other paintings to get a better glimpse. And this is the kind of stuff I'm, I'm going to do. Um, and I can't even tell you what I have. So I, ha I keep a cue. Um, you guys know what a cue is. You, you have Netflix. So I'm painting one painting and with oil paints, which is what I painted. Um, sometimes the paints need to dry because so you can paint the next layer. But sometimes they need to be wet so you can blend in the next layer. So they can take quite a while sometimes. And when that happens, what I want to do is I will pick out another canvas and come up with what I'm going to paint next and start that. Anyway, so I'll be around so you can see these closer. Um, this one is called uh, Pretty Poison. I think, yeah, Pretty Poison. I named it after a book, sort of, um, in the Black Jewel trilogy. If you've never read it, it is an awesome uh, series. It's actually not a trilogy, despite the fact that it says it is one. Um, anyway, so in it there's like this saying that happens, which is, um, Briarwood is a pretty poison. That's how this got its name. Each painting is done to a specific song. This one right here, Lullaby of a Stormy Night. You should look it up. So you're already on YouTube, obviously. Look up Lullaby of a Stormy Night. It is gorgeous. Not the painting, but the song. I mean, the painting's pretty good. These are my flowers. These were my first flowers. Uh, though the flowers didn't quite come out the way they were supposed to. They were supposed to be cherry blossoms. The branches came out spectacularly. So I'll probably teach you how to do that texture look, teach you, show you what I did to get it. This one's harder to see because the shiny will pick up any glare. Um, but yeah, let's see if that helps. Well, sort of, I guess, a little bit. Uh, for instance, this right here looks like there's a, a white there, but it's not. It's just shiny. Think there, see, when I come off to the side, shiny, okay. he's from that direction. And my son said I hated this one. I felt so fucking failure with this one. I tried so hard, but I ended up giving up and this is the end product of it. Um, I may do another one in the future. Uh, two of my blanket abstracts. Look at this one right here. This was meant to be a poppy field. If you look closely, I did a little trick. See how it's shimmering? So I did a little trick by adding in, um, I don't know if you guys uh, know this or seen this, I don't know who, what demographic would be watching this, but um, there's this glitter that you usually get for prom and it goes on your face and stuff. And I got it from my daughter a couple years ago because she was a fairy butterfly or butterfly fairy something. And so I sprayed it on her face so she glittered and shined. Anyway, so I found it and I was like, oh, that'd be really pretty if I could get the painting to, if I could incorporate that into the painting. So that's how the poppy field came about. Anyway, I'm not gonna take you to the other ones in the other room. You'll see those later. I mostly just wanted to introduce myself. Um, Outside of the paintings, the type of blog-like things they'll talk about can often be very serious. So, I'm also going to add that there may be a trigger warning. Because, um, I don't have the best relationship with my mom. And there was a whole little, you know, a little. <laughs> so, um, a inconveniently, slightly abusive childhood. So, sometimes that stuff will crop up, especially if I need to talk about it. And you know what I mean, sometimes... If you get it out, you feel better, so you journal or diary. So this is going to be partly my journal, too. Sometimes I'll pop.
probably won't talk too much about the past, but you're right. Um, anyway, so things like that and politics. I know you guys like politics. Religion. All of the tough, intense topics. But also the really light ones like book recommendations. Uh, um, if you're a sci-fi lover, okay. So if I give you book recommendations, they're probably going to be sci-fi, fantasy, uh, young adult, or uh, manga. I read manga too. So uh, for any kind of like reviews on um, TV, mostly Asian dramas and sci-fi shows. And like I said, all this will be done while I'm painting. So you'll be able to see me and hear whatever it is I'm talking about, and I'll be painting at the same time. You'll be able to see the painting. You'll probably be able to see the painting better than me because I'll angle it at the camera so that you can see exactly what I'm doing. Um, uh, later on, I will add a, uh, a donation button for PayPal if you want to donate to my painting funds. I don't know if you guys ever bought paint. I'm going to assume if you're watching this video, you have an interest in painting or you do paint or you did paint, or maybe you just like watching painting, but um, paints can be really, really expensive. You go through them really quick and make special rules. And next thing you know, you're like, oh, starving artist. This is how artists become starving, by the way. Their paints cost a mint. Some of the best colors out there cost 35, 40, 50, 100 bucks for one tiny tube. Um, I would get up to show you, but <laughs> I just sat back down. I'll show you in my next video. Um, anyway. So I do hope you guys enjoy the video and uh, videos and welcome to my channel. Okay, I'm going to leave you guys now. If you have any questions, feel free to comment. I'll answer. Um, I think you can message me. And oh, if you have any suggestions or ideas or um, you're curious whether or not I've seen something or read something and you want to know whether or not it was good or if you're having a difficult time with a specific painting thing that maybe you, it looks like I can do and you can't find it anywhere, feel free to ask. Feel free to reach out. Um, I should be checking on this about once a day or two. I want every other day, once a day, and I'll probably put out a video about once a week. Sometimes more and sometimes less, depending on, you know, all the things going on in my life. So, now, goodbye. I hope you enjoy the channel.